happening? What is happening for my Leo? We got the Ace of Swords. We got the Queen of Swords. And then we have the Page of Wands reversed. So there could be somebody that is changing their mind about something. And it has something to do with the truth. Maybe the truth could be that someone's not ready to have something long term. Whether you could be telling this person this or they could be telling you that. But somebody made their mind up. Like they may have changed their mind. Wow. Some of y'all, someone's ambition makes somebody not not want to, to be with the other person. Maybe some of y'all could be dealing with somebody that may be jealous of you. Whether you are making more money than them or whether you have more, more than them in general. I don't know. Wow. But I'm hearing your drive, your ambition, your strength has someone wanted to turn their back on you. Because they are, I'm hearing you are doing better than them, Leo. Wow, we got the Knight of Swords. And they conflicted about that. Some of y'all dealing with a jealous lover. Or it don't even have to be a lover. It could be a lover. Mostly all it is that really changed their mind about offering you a commitment. Or changed their mind about being in a relationship with you. If you are already in a relationship, maybe, they, maybe, maybe taking it back. But it don't even have to be a commitment, like a relationship, like a romance commitment. It could be anything they tried to take back from you. It can be something like a car they bought you. It can be um, something tangible they bought you. It can be, you know, like I said, it could be clothes. It could be a car they bought you. It could be something that they had gave you, right? Or something that they was about to give you, but they could be taking it back. Y'all take what resonate, because I'm seeing both energy. Most of y'all, it's something that you already in, and they just want to take it back. Because this person is jealous of your success, Leo. It's something about you. Either they're jealous of your success, or you know, your ambition, or whatever. Or it could be you are somebody that is more intelligent. Maybe you, you see your intelligence, Leo, um, that this person could be, I'm hearing, intimidated by. I don't know. You could be somebody that is more smart. Maybe you are smarter than this person. And this person is a little bit younger than you. But the truth is, your person is conflicted. And they may try to come in and stir some drama. Some of y'all be careful because this person may try to come in. That's how jealous they is. They may try to come in and stir up some drama or make up an excuse or something. I don't know. Or y'all start arguing after they tell you this. Y'all start arguing. Yeah, some of y'all, maybe you could be going to school. Some of you guys could be studying, researching something. Maybe you guys could be, I don't know, you could be somebody that's in school and maybe you're jealous of the simple fact that you want to further your ed education, Leo, for some of y'all. Or it could, some of y'all could be your own mother that could be holding something against you. Like, well, since you got this, um, well, well, maybe I should take this back or maybe I shouldn't get this for you. It could be something like that. Some of y'all can be your own mama. It can be your own pe your own peoples, right? Or it can be your own lover. Y'all take what resonate. But I feel like they really trying to like come up in here and stir up some drama or y'all gonna end up having a little, um, heated discussion. Yes, it's because somebody has been watching your every move. Page of Wands reversed and the Page of Wands upright. That tells me that, yes, somebody you doing better than, Leo, they are jealous of you. You are somebody that has worked really, really hard for whatever it is that's about to come your way. This is some form of extended offer. So whatever they don't get or whatever they don't have, they are jealous of it because you are having a lot more opportunities than this person, Leo. Or it could be a group of people. Some of y'all's people watching y'all because it's like the page of sword. People watching you, stalking you, trying to study you, trying to, you know, it's like they're trying to figure out who you are or your whereabouts, like what opportunities that you got or what you got going on. If this is not a lover, if this is not a relative, this could just people on social media that is 
watching you and they're jealous and they're conflicted about how educated you are. Like, I, I feel like you are somebody who is very smart, Leo, you know, and you just, you, you, you have a lot of, um, you could be very, I'm here, a very skilled individual in a lot of areas in your life. Maybe you master a lot of things real easily. You know what I'm saying? Like, soon as you do something, you like catch on to it really, really fast. But somebody is very afraid of your strengths, your, your, your ambition, um, your mind. They're watching you get these opportunities. Wow. Some of y'all got jealous people around y'all that don't like the simple fact how well educated and driven you are as an individual. All because you want more and they want to sit on their tail. You see what I'm saying? That's the energy that I'm picking up on. It's just jealousy. Okay, what else do we have? Some of y'all your own sister. Somebody could have a twin, but maybe y'all two different people. Somebody have a twin. Somebody could be your own sister or your own brother or your own siblings, because this is all pages, page of swords, page of wands, page of wands, like I said, maybe somebody could be a twin, whether you or another sibling of yours is a twin, some of y'all have twin, twin relatives, and maybe they're jealous of your success, somebody around you is jealous of your success, and how educational you are, like how educated you are, I meant to say, how smart you are, how driven you are, some of y'all your own kids, if, if you the mama, some of your own kids, that's not even happy for you. Some of y'all your own kids. are not even happy for you. That's crazy. Somebody have three daughters. Not everybody. Like I said, y'all take a resume. I'm seeing so many different energies for so many different groups of Leos. But with these pages, these are kids. Like some of y'all got kids jealous of y'all. Or y'all got sisters, siblings jealous of you. I feel like it's in every area, to be honest. A lot of y'all got a lot of people jealous of your strength, your, like I said, everything. Everything that, that comes with you, they're jealous of you. And some of them conflicted because they don't want to let you go. Especially if you're leaving or moving somewhere to further your education. They conflicted because these are people that sleep I'm here. You could be somebody that is spiritually woke. That these people are asleep I'm here. Devils, look. Sleep, unawakened devils. I'm here, unawakened demons that is watching your move and jealous of the opportunities that come your way. Yes, I feel like you could be somebody who has many gifts, many talents. Some of you guys have multiple businesses, or maybe you juggle a lot. Like, you could have a job, then you go to school, then you have a business on the side. I don't know why, but they, and it's crazy because these could be people that, some of y'all's people on the media that's watching you that is toxic because they want what you want. Either way, the media, your sisters, your kids, I don't know who this is, your love interests, they want what you, what they can't get. Well, they, I ain't saying they can't get it. They want what you got, right? These people want what you have. But I'm hearing unawakened demons. You could be somebody that has a lot of boundaries. Maybe you could be somebody that is very strict. But at the same time, they want to hold on to you. There could be people that still wants to hold on to you. But it's also telling me that some of you guys have supporters around you because it says support, boundary, strength. So the people that is closer to you, like I'm, I'm here, okay, this is the energy I'm getting. You have people that is close to you that could be jealous of your success, but they want to hold on to you, right? But you also have people in the background that is actually supporting you. I'm hearing y'all have haters left and right. Y'all have supporters left and right. Either way, you know, it's going to be both. But I just feel like somebody that don't like, they don't like to see you win. They want to see you struggle. This is that person. I don't know why. Some of y'all got people that love you and hate you. Like, this energy is weird. And like I said, Asa... Ace of Cups, that's love. So that could be your love, love interest, like your 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 kids or your, you know, your lover or 
your soul, I don't know, your soul family. It can be anybody that you consider as family. They they really they really envy. They really jealous of you, Leo. Because you want to get out here and further educate yourself and be a better person and make more money. Because like I said, y'all expanding in y'all work, y'all business, y'all career, whatever y'all got going on, there is some form of, I'm hearing opportunities left and right. I'm here, the more you don't give these people your energy, the more you don't pay these people no, people no mind, the more opportunities that you get and the more, you'll, more money you make. It is what it is. This was supposed to be a love spread. It didn't came out to be a whole, a whole other thing. But it, I'm just, I guess that's what spirit want me to let out. Cause y'all got some people that's really like jealous of the opportunities that you get, but they want to sit on their tail and don't, they don't want to do nothing. Like I said, y'all worked hard. Yeah, y'all been through a lot. I'm hearing a lot of y'all did all of this on y'all own. I'm hearing it's going to be lonely at the top. Some of y'all probably feeling this, feel like this energy right now. Maybe you feel like it is lonely at the top. Because these are mountains and it is one person over here. It's three. But it's one person right here and two other people over there. Like I said, some of y'all still got people supporting you. But it's, it's, it's very few people that is very, you know, supportive around you. But... Nine times out of ten, you alone. But spirit got your back, though. Guidance? What? Some of y'all could be chosen. Maybe you consider yourself as somebody that is chosen, Leo. But it is telling me that it gets lonely at the top. But spirit got your back. No matter who it is, Leo, that is jealous of you, that envy you, that don't want to see you level up, spirit going to have your back regardless. They got a lot of offers. Y'all doesn't understand. I'm here taking chances. So like a lot of y'all taking a lot of chances. But it's telling me that y'all got a lot of opportunities and money and work and business and career. It's because you putting yourself out there. You taking chances. Y'all putting yourself out there. Y'all are taking chances. Whether you are aware of, you know, you whether you okay, for an example, you saw another application for a job or a resume, right? And you already got a job. You just about to fill out an application and send in, you know, whether you get the job or not, you don't care because you already making money. You see what I'm saying? Where you at? So it's like no matter what, you still have opportunities waiting for you, Leo. Like literally. That's how jealous these people is. Some of y'all about to gamble. Some of y'all about to win some money at the casino. Or you could be playing the lottery. You could be playing scratch-off tickets or something. Or you could be paying, playing something like the Powerball or the Mega Millions or whatever it is. Cash Five. I don't know. But somebody about the one. Somebody could be playing threes. Somebody could be hitting for threes. Maybe you could be playing um, pick three, I'm hearing. Somebody could be playing three, three, three. Wow. I'm hearing threes. Everything coming in threes. You know what threes is? All about new beginnings. All about instantly. Um, I can't even say the word. We're going to say happiness. We're going to say advancement. Some of y'all are getting advancement. Some, some of y'all are getting settlements. Maybe there are people that is jealous of the money that is owed to you. Whether this is a settlement. Whether this is a retirement funding. A check or something. Whether this is some social security. I don't know what it is. It could be income tax check. It could be you buying a new car. It could be people showing you some love. It could be just things coming together for you. Things balancing out for you. Things are expanding. Things are growing in every area of your life. And people are jealous of that. They are jealous of that. But like I said, y'all out here grinding. Y'all out here taking chances. I'm here. I'm out here trying to get it. Like a lot of y'all are really out here grinding and trying to, you know, make some money. And some of y'all could be in survival mode. And that's why your grind is so strong. That's why your drive is so strong. Because you feel like you have to juggle multiple things in order to get where you need to get. Hey, you gotta nowadays you gotta have at least three jobs to, to survive. You know, and I just feel like no matter what you do, like people is very like jealous of that. Just observing your every move, like how happy you is. People are even jealous of how happy you is. Like, that's crazy. Just watching you, stalking you. Like, they ain't got nothing to do. 
They're super lazy, whoever this is. They don't have no drive. They don't have no ambition. It's like the more you pay attention, like re redirect that energy back onto yourself with the page of wands, and then we got it uh, um, up right up under it, the more opportunities are being thrown at you out of nowhere. For some of y'all, if y'all got a business, some of y'all got a secret business. Some of y'all, y'all have, like, maybe a lot of people don't know this, but maybe you have started a business behind the scenes, Leo. And, and maybe some of your friends and family members don't know that you have started a business. Because I am getting that also. But it's growing behind the scenes. It has been slow, I'm hearing, but it's growing behind the scenes. I'm hearing, it, it, it was lonely at the top, Leo. And some of y'all, like I said, y'all still in this energy, but spirit got your back. Some people are obsessed with your light. Some people are obsessed with your light. How free you are. How authentic you are. When I look at a naked person, I look at someone being authentic. You know what I'm saying? Not giving an F. Not caring. It's like the star card. Some of y'all could have Aquarius in y'all chart or maybe Sagittarius. I look at this as Sag also. Somebody could have Capricorn in their astrology chart. But y'all out here getting it. Like y'all out here making money. Y'all got y'all little side hustles, little side businesses, little side gigs going on, getting ready to start. Like, and it's crazy. Like, y'all got a lot of people that won't want to hold on to you because you win it. But at the same time, they don't like you. They don't like the progress you made. But they want to be around to eat off of your energy. That's exactly what I just heard. It's like they'll sit there and watch. You. They want to be down. They want to watch it. But they don't want to support it. You see what I'm saying? But you are being supported. Even if you feel alone, Leo. And you know why these people won't let you go? Because they need you for real. Like I said, whether this is your kids, they can be grown. You know, because anything can happen, right? There is, you know, mothers and fathers out here that still take care of their kids while they're grown. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Like I said, they still holding on. It could be your, your kids. It could be you um, being... I'm, I'm hearing somebody of an inspiration to somebody i'm here a role model that's exactly what i heard when i look at these two cards you are a role model to other people and you got other people want to be like you even though they don't like you even though they don't like the opportunities you're getting and how smart you are just know that you are more of somebody that people look up to and that's why they want to hold on you know and, and and it's like they don't take from you but whether this is your energy or the money or whatever it is you provide, but at the same time, they don't want to be supportive. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just picking up on that energy. But some of y'all feel like y'all alone. Y'all ain't alone. Y'all got people. Some people actually depend on you. Like I said, some of y'all doing this for y'all kids. When I look at that card, some of y'all doing this for y'all kids. If you were single parent, you are grinding for your children. Because I'm hearing that some of y'all have been doing all of this stuff for way too long alone. But just know that things are going to get better and better and better and better because spirit got your back, period. Spirit got your back. Yep, some people want to hold on to see you fall. But it's still going to be opportunities coming in. They can't stop you. They can't. Look, Ten of Pentacles, they can't stop you. Because you could be somebody that is very much healed. You're not wasting no time with nobody that you, you know that's there for the wrong reason. You're going to win regardless. You're going to win regardless. With the Ten of Pentacles, what? That's generational wealth. That's a solid foundation, a solid family. You gonna you if you a single parent, you and your kids are gonna be good. Or if you somebody that's in a relationship with somebody with children, you're gonna be good. Or if you could be single, you probably ain't got no kids or no partner, and you still gonna be good. But I feel like a lot of y'all have been doing grinding all this, you know, alone for a very long time with no help. But it is telling me y'all walking away for things that don't fill you up. Things that don't show no love. 
things that don't support you, th things, people, place, things, everything, right? Things that don't make you happy. A lot of y'all are walking away from it. Y'all really is. Because like I said, you, some of y'all could be upset, but you, I'm hearing I forgive, but I don't forget. You see what I'm saying? But tell them, it's telling me that the people that don't want to see you succeed and they are jealous of the simple fact that you are doing a lot better than they is. These people ain't happy with themselves. They could be holding a lot of resentment. I'm hearing a lot of hate in their heart when I look at the Three of Swords reverse. These people hold a lot of hate in their heart, Leo. And they can't even manifest. These people don't have that power, that control of themselves, of their heart. And you know what's really telling me, Leo, that the people that's looking down on you or whatever, I surely feel like these people need to get their heart together in order to manifest. Somebody, and some of y'all, this could be your energy. Maybe you are looking down upon somebody and they success, right? You know, I'm going to keep it real. And Spirit is saying that the reason why you may not be getting the things that you wish for is because your heart ain't right. Your heart ain't right. It, it You can't manifest with your heart ain't right. Your intentions is not right. You know, yeah, I feel like a lot of people could be like, I'm just getting this energy where y'all could be, y'all got a lot going on, Leo, but it's for the better. It's not to look down nobody. It's not to, you know, be, or, or any of that, compare yourself to nobody or any of that. I feel like you're doing this for you. You have been doing this by yourself for so long. I'm hearing nobody has been taking care of me, but me. But just know y'all do have people in your circle that is taking back. It's like they change, they switching up on you, on how you, they used to view you and willing to be there for you. Some of y'all got some support, some supporting people in, around you, your family or your friends or whatever that have supported you before. But then it's like the more you rise to the top, they take back. The support. I'm getting that. It's like on and off support. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm getting for some of my Leos. It's like they wishy washy. They don't know if they want to. They don't want to. They want to support you and they be and be happy for you, or they don't. They don't know if they want to just don't support you and and be hating on you. You know what I'm saying? It's like some of y'all got wishy washy people that just play both sides. You know, they in front of you. I'm hearing they smile on your face, but they really want to take your place. Like for real. Okay, what else do we have, Spirit? Home. Some of y'all about to get a new home, whether you're about to purchase a new house, um, whether you are renting out a home or you're, or you're building a home. I'm hearing land. Somebody could be a landlord or somebody could be a real estate investor or into real estate of some sort, whether you are a real estate agent, like I said, or a landlord or a realtor, something like that. But some of y'all about to get a home, whether you're buying it or renting or not right or you're doing business but you got a lot on your plate some of y'all could be having problems with your home when i look at these two cards with home and lighten your load i feel like things could be getting really bad in the home like maybe for an example you need a lot of fixing in the home and maybe you feel like it's one thing after another that could be breaking down in the home and you could just be wanting another home a lot of you guys are definitely fixated on getting a new home so you can feel comfortable but um i'm hearing that something is being built upon for you to get a home or you saving up some money to get a home something like that y'all manifesting y'all really is some of y'all could be wanting to have that business or that move or to buy that house or something i don't know but some of y'all feel like home has been very stressful but it's about to get better with the six on top of this man's back it's about to get better sixes is all about sixes is all about harmony things you know things coming together 
things balancing it out. I'm hearing a lot of responsibilities. Y'all have a lot going on in the home front when it comes to home. Some of y'all de definitely moving. And this is something you manifested. Some of y'all are definitely moving. Maybe you have a maybe you have a really big house and you have so much to move out of your house, Leo. But you are empowered right now. You really is. You are in control. So like I said, some of y'all could be homeowners. Secret homeowners. Some of y'all gonna be moving in silence. Some of y'all are going to be moving in silence, whether you're doing a physical move or you're going to be making boss moves in silence. That's exactly what I'm hearing for some of my Leos, boss moves. But let's see what we got. We're going to clear into the message. Wow, we got heartbroken. Somebody is hurt about a separation, Leo. This is somebody that you walked away from. They could be talking, gossiping about you to other people. Some of y'all gonna end up hearing from them. Some of y'all gonna end up hearing from somebody that you had some form of a breakup with. Because this person wants to talk to you, whoever this is. This person is going to want to, some of y'all could just be saying that this is somebody that broke your heart that is getting ready to reach out to you. It could be the other way around. Just like I said, you know, somebody that has broke your heart could be reaching out to you. But it's over. I feel like this is somebody that you have gave the silent treatment to, or maybe they've done this to you. You have It's saying that y'all haven't heard from this person in a very long time, Leo. So some of y'all is telling me in love that Somebody that has broken your heart in the past or recently is getting ready to reach out to you. But you could be ignoring their calls, their text messages. You could be you some of y'all are going to completely treat this person like they did because we got coffin right here. Telling me y'all done. Yeah, because you got other opportunities, you know, that is presented to you. That's why you're taking chances. Like I said, this is all about y'all. Having opportunities, taking chances, and, you know, making money. A lot of y'all are definitely making some money. Some of y'all, this is somebody that has some form of addiction. Maybe they have a gambling addiction. Some of y'all are telling me this is somebody that gambled your heart. Maybe they had other people in the mix of y'all situation or y'all relationship, and they broke your heart, so you left. Or they may have ghosted you. That could be part of it. Some of y'all, part of them breaking your heart is ghosting you. And now, all of a sudden, they want to reach out to you? And start over. This is somebody you gave way too many chances to. But I'm hearing play your cards right. Some of this is telling me that some of y'all need to use discernment when this person come back. Because some of y'all is flat out ignoring them and letting them go. The rest of y'all is telling me that y'all need to use discernment. Especially if you're thinking about taking this person back. Yeah, it's over. A lot of y'all... It's over. I feel like y'all are moving forward. Y'all making money alone. And you you cutting people off. Y'all cutting somebody off. And, and whoever this is, Leo, they're going to be very shocked by this. They, I don't think that they didn't realize that you wanted to reject them. I don't know who they think they is. You'll just pop up in somebody's life after you ghosted them. I know I got my opinion. <laughs> yep, because you see it for who it really is. Yep, it's all about awareness. We got the dragonfly. Things coming to light. So yes, you cutting these people out that have stabbed you in the stabbed you in the back in the past, and you're moving on because you've seen these people for who they really is. I'm here, ain't no changing nothing. You have outgrown these people. I'm hearing grown boys. Some of y'all are leaving young-minded people behind. They need to grow up. Man or woman. You know? For some of y'all fellas, y'all leaving young-minded women. Or y'all need to grow. Some of y'all want a grown woman. You know? And I don't blame y'all. A lot of people these days is just childish. They have that mindset of a kid. Grown too. Grown people do. Sad. We got love call. And they still gonna try you. They still gonna try you and and explain themselves. Somebody is going to reach somebody from the past that has broken your heart 
It's going to come in your life, Leo, to make it up to you. But like I said, y'all have outgrown these people. No matter how much explaining that they do, y'all ain't taking them back. It is what it is. They keep telling me that some of y'all have to reject this person a few times. Because they don't want to give up. Some of y'all reject somebody a few times because they don't want to give up. Or it could just be saying that, yeah, I feel like that's what it is. One more. Yeah, you done. You gone. We got the runner. You leaving them behind. They're trying to sweet talk you, Leo. You are leaving this person behind. You're not allowing this person to sweet talk you. It is what it is. You're not. You ain't, you, you're not stuck on stupid with this at all. You leaving this person right where they at because they got you effed up <laughs> i'm here they got me all the way effed up and it's crazy because they come back always when you're doing a lot better all the time all the time you are too nice i don't deserve your kindness i don't know that could be for somebody Maybe you was too nice for this person and they didn't deserve your kindness. They didn't deserve you. Some of y'all feel like this is somebody that has taken advantage of you and your love. And that's why you're gone. I can't take it anymore. Yeah, it's saying that it's a wrap. They keep telling me a lot of y'all are shut it down. Like, when I say shut, y'all shut it it's down. Like, y'all got people so invested but they really don't f with you and then you got people that is taking back things from you that they gave you or promised you all because you have something a lot better than them you know it's just a lot of jealousy a lot of hate a lot of envy around you you do have some su some supporters but very few but spirit still got your back that's exactly what i heard Spirit still got your back because some of y'all are doing this for y'all. Some of y'all are doing this for your kids. If you got kids, y'all, this ain't about nobody else I'm hearing. This, this grind is not nobody else. I feel like everything is for you and outgrowing the old you and evolving as an individual and getting better and better and better and better and better and better, and better until you are at a spot where you feel like you are more comfortable. You know what I'm saying? And I just keep hearing this is not about them. Everything is just about you. But for some reason, they just jealous. But I'm going to go ahead and end it right here, Leo. I hope it resonates and y'all take care.